so this is the wrap up to the Unity section. So I want to you know, wrap up the unity and also just give you a, a flow for finishing the rest of your course. So what do I mean by that? Well, at this point, uh, if this is your first time through, you've hopefully listened to my advice and you've only done like maybe one, two or three holes. Um, so what I want you to do at this point is take those holes um, and move on to planting vegetation doing your 3DG, which is actually optional, and then compiling or slash building your course um, for, you know, so that you can actually play in, in GS Pro. So you're now able to play um, in GS Pro. You went through Greenkeeper as well. After you're able to play in GS Pro to finish the rest of everything, you're going to need to go back into Inkscape, finish the rest of your holes, and I would recommend you do two or three holes at a time, make sure it, it goes through Clender cleanly. Um, and then once you have all 18 holes done um, and you've run it through Clender and it's working, you can import those meshes into Unity overwriting the old ones. Okay, so your the initial two or three holes that you have, you can overwrite those. Then once you are comfortable that your meshes are finalized, they're, hey, you don't need to change any of their shapes. Um, and for the most part, it's pretty easy to change you know, terrain. I've showed you how to do that. Um, then once you're done, that's when I would say spend that time vert painting either in Blender or Unity. But just remember, you're going to want to vert paint first in Blender because then you can import those on and you paint in Unity. If you go back and you try to do other things in Blender later on, it's going to overwrite anything you did in Unity. Okay. Then when all your meshes are done, they're vert painted, finish your 3G, finish your trees, do your final Greenkeeper workflow, and then uh, publish and play your course. OK, so my recommendation here and what I want you to learn is do not do a ton of vert painting in Blender. Do not do a ton of vert paint and spending a lot of time for painting in Unity until you are confident that your meshes are finalized, the final shapes, um, and that you do not need to do any more Inkscape changes or send anything through Clender. That is my recommended advice.